Mr. Anderson, who's Randy? As I said in my opening remarks, I would be delighted to share that information with you in camera only, simply based on the turmoil that I have gone through in my personal life. Uh, uh, sir, that's not uh, how this works. So you're obligated to provide fulsome answers to the committee. I'm going to ask you again, who is Randy? Randy, as I said in my opening statement, was an autocorrect. Okay. Who, is, who are Shauna and Felix at Global Health Imports? Shauna Parker was in our shipping department. Felix was the account manager for the Quebec government. In 2022, who were the partners at GHI? In September, federal corporate registries in September of 2021 was registered as me, provincially registered. It was both myself and Minister Boisenault. According to text messages we have from you from September 6, 2022, Randy and Felix were to have a partner vote on a wire transfer to your business. It says, quote, so we are game tomorrow, or what do we expect will be the delay tomorrow? I am sending email to Randy and Felix right now, but I know if I send this and we miss tomorrow, it will be done. They will have a partner vote on this, end quote. A partner vote on a multi-million dollar deal, um, that Randy is not an autocorrect. That's Randy Boissonneau, correct? No. Mr. Chair, I, requ I respect the question. However, Global Health, we, were, we had two companies, Global Health Imports and Global Healthcare Solutions. Okay, so how many Randys at GHI have ever participated in partner votes? Global Health Imports up until September of 2021 was Mr. Boisenault. And then you replaced him with another Randy? As I've told you, it was an autocorrect for another company, and I would certainly share that with you if you would like so to go not, on camera. Not, not Global Health Imports? We were, if you're referring to an ongoing text message that was sent by Global News from the Gowie Group, which is where I'm assuming you're, this is where this is going, the Gowie Group had a contract in place with Global Health Imports and Global Healthcare Solutions. So another text message from you says, sorry, I'm very confused. I updated Randy, Shauna, Felix, and our CFO. Yikes. OMG, this lady has me crazy, end quote. Was that... An autocorrect, or was that Randy Boissonneau? Randy Boissonneau was never involved in the operating business of Global Health Imports after September of 2021. So we've got Randy, Shauna, and Felix, but it's and it's a partner call, but you maintain that it's not Randy Boissonneau. Mr. Mr. So, Chair, I respectfully uh, say so that... Please, please don't interrupt, sir. How many people work for Global Health Imports? What's the total staff complement? 121. How many are named Randy? Global Health Imports, there was one up until September 2021, Randy Boisenault. You, uh, Mr. Henderson, um, what happened to the half million dollars that was um, paid to GHI by Gowie Group? That is an ongoing litigation. There was a decision and it has been publicized by the courts as of last Okay, I stopped the uh, clock. Go ahead, uh, Mr. Green. I say this uh, for respect uh, of the witness. It, it might be helpful, uh, Mr. Chair, if you apprise the witness of uh, what his privileges are in this committee in terms of what can and can't be used against him so that he can answer the committee in a full way re without having to kind of rely on of the civil litigation, but if it's my understanding through you, sir, to the clerk or whomever wants to clarify, that he also uh, assumes privilege when te when testifying here. Therefore, uh, anything that is said here cannot, as I understand, legally be used against him in a civil proceeding. Is that correct? Yeah, uh, Mr. Green, I, I was actually going to intervene shortly on this and uh, remind Mr. Anderson that he is in front of a parliamentary committee that uh, the full privileges. Uh, are applied to him as they are to members uh, with respect to parliamentary privilege and that uh, Mr. Anderson does have an obligation to answer to the best of his ability the uh, questions that are being asked by committee members. And so, sir, I'm going to ask that you respect uh, as equally the privileges of members to ask these committees and uh, your obligation to answer them with an understanding that you are protected uh, by parliamentary privilege. So I am going to uh, continue the clock, and I want to thank you, Mr. Green, for that intervention. Mr. Barrett, you have two minutes and 31 seconds. Go ahead, please. 
Did Randy Boissonneau uh, uh, receive any benefit from the $500,000 payment from Gowie Group to your company? Gowie Group contact, Mr. Chairman, was entered into in September of 2022. As we've reiterated, Mr. Boissonneau was not involved with the company after September of 2021. In, in, 2020, 20, in 2022, uh, where was GHI's office? It was in Edmonton, is that correct? We had two offices. And yes. where were they? Edmonton and Broussard, Quebec. So text from you on September 8th, 2022 say, sorry to be an annoyance, I have them all on me. Everyone is in the office and asking, everyone being Randy, Shauna, and Felix. Is that right? Who, who, would, who was everyone that was on you in respect to that text message? In September of 2022, we had a vandalism which the Edmonton City Police were involved with at 3.42 in the morning, and there was a break and enter and an arson in our facility. We so, were so I just need to know, who was everyone? Is it Randy, Sean, and Felix? No, it was all employees that worked in the building. Okay. The text goes on to say, I have Felix walking in and Shauna every 15 minutes. Was, was, and that's in this text message. Was Randy there in Edmonton? No. The text continues and says, calling Randy now to advise. Randy was, was he the, the principal? Is that why Randy needed to be made aware? You're referring to a text message, Mr. Chairman, for 2022. Randy Boisenault, I have not spoken to in 2022. Okay. Nor so, on text message, which he supplied his text messages to the ethics okay. commissioner, which has ruled we haven't so, spoken. So, so let's, let's put it this way. September 6, 2022, where you say you need to update Randy on a wire transfer because the West Coast, Coast is closing in seven minutes and Randy is in the Vancouver office. Do you know what... Randy was in Vancouver, Vancouver on September 6, 2022. Well, it was Liberal Cabinet Minister Randy Boissonneau in Vancouver at a cabinet retreat. So you say it's an autocorrect. That's quite the autocorrect, sir. Mr. Chairman, I resent the fact that the member is making an accusation against me. Uh, I'm not said, making an accusation. Said, I'm, I'm, I'm showing you and reading your text. We're over time. Time. If you're allowed to ask I'm a question, I should be able to answer. Just we're, do so honestly. We're... We're uh, past the time, Mr. Barrett. Thank you. Uh, we're going to go.